hello guys welcome to my channel today i have a package for you all today we're going to be doing a lesson on inversions so today we're going to be doing lessons on inversions first of all what are inversions inversions are different ways by which you can play a particular chord particular chord okay i'm going to be demonstrating the key of c okay before i continue this video video check if you don't know anything about major chords you do well to check my previous video because i got that covered in my previous video so i'm just going to do the continuation okay today we're going to be doing the concept of inversions okay for example now this is the c major okay now if you look, notice the c major is a combination of c e and g okay so if you want to invert this chord if we hold e and g what will be left is c so we could take the c here this is an inversion of this it's the same thing that's how we call it an inversion so this is an inversion of of the, of the C major let's call this the first inversion okay if you hold G C G and C what will be left is E so you could just put the E here let's call this the second inversion so here we have the root this is the root this is the C major the first inversion we have the first inversion here first inversion and we have the second inversion so it, it goes the same for all the other major or the other notes of the major scale or the other chords for example this this is rare which is two this is the chord is a combination of d f and a so if this is the root if you hold f and a what will be left is d so you could just take the d from here let's call this the first inversion and if you take a and d what will be left is f so let's call this the second inversion so here's the root here's the root that's the root this is the first inversion and this is the second inversion okay now it goes same for all the other all the other chords this is the third this is the root this is the first inversion and this is the second inversion take note when when you want to invert a chord you have to follow no first of all know the the different notes which different notes or keys which come together to form that chord once you know it then you're good to go so here is the four this is the four this is the four this is the root this is the first inversion and this is the second inversion it goes same so find the ones for the remaining notes of the scale the main cause of the scale okay now the concept of invention will help you in playing many songs many songs for example let's take this progression concept of inversion you could use the concept of inversions on playing this progression for example you use let's say this inversion of the six this is an inversion of the six okay this is an inversion of the six because the six is a combination of 
is a combination of A, C, and E. So if you hold this chord here, here we have C, here we have E, and here we have A. So this is the inversion of the six. So playing this, you could use this concept of inversion the six to move to the four. You must not necessarily come here, but could still use this inversion and back to one. And then you could use this inversion to this inversion of the five. So here we have six. If if you're still if you haven't learned how to hold chords well, you could still hold the bass notes, or you could Just the note intervals. The four, the one, this inversion of the five. Or if you haven't learned how to hold the chords yet very well, you could still use the bass notes. to play this progression okay I hope this lesson was really helpful to you don't forget to hit the subscribe button and don't forget to hit the notifications it will notify you once I drop a new video stay tuned thank you